So I'm in my chair. You have a chair at home, don't you, sir? Damn right you have a chair. Because you're a man. That's your throne. You know that, right? If you ever went missing, she would have to give a cushion in that chair to a bloodhound. Find that smell! And then they'd revive the dog and send him on his way, of course. Paddles clear. Go, champ! Find our king. Did you ever notice these politicians, all their pictures are like this? It's like as if wisdom just floats by and they can pick it up. I always see pictures of AOC, just... The erudite AOC. You know, I just, it's like, I, can't, I wonder what they're looking at. Maybe it's wisdom. It's just, we, they see things we don't. Was she, you think? She's an economist, though. Yeah, it's all free. Anyway, um, this is, the, oh, I'm in my chair. Now, she comes up behind me, and she's rubbing me like that. She's got her arms around me like that. She's nibbling on my ear, and I'm thinking, is it February 29th? <laughs> I don't know how Siri missed that, because it's in my phone. It was a few minutes of a very, very nice, warm, tender moment between a man and wife. And at that time, we were in our 20-some years of marriage. And a uh, beautiful moment. And after a few minutes of just very affectionate, she kisses my head. She hugs me, and she nibbles on my ear. She goes, I love you, Jeffy, so much. I said, I love you too, baby. And she walks away. Beautiful moment. And I'm, bask I'm basking in the one. I'm sitting in my chair. A good 15 minutes just in my, yeah, thinking about that. That was really nice. And then my son comes walking by, and he looks at me, and he goes, Dad, who drew the big smiley face on your bald spot? <laughs> Yeah, what I thought was fingernails was a Sharpie. She was back there stroking me with one hand and doing artwork on my dome with the other. So don't you feel sorry for her. I'm telling you, she's a sick, twisted, dark thing. <laughs>